Um, did he contribute to your attorney general campaign? I think he did. Okay. I, 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 th I think he did um, directly to my campaign or to a PAC that was associated with my campaign or to a PAC that was associated with Mark Shirtless campaign. I can't remember how he contributed, but he contributed to a shotgun event that we held in the fall of 2012. Okay, and if it had been contributed to a PAC, would that have shown up on your campaign disclosures? Whatever the rules were, they would have been followed. I had a professional treasurer who tracked all of that and reported all of that. So you don't know the answer? Well, for example, if, if a campaign contribution was made to Mark Shirtless PAC, for example, and Mark Shirtliff later donated to my campaign through his PAC, I don't know if that would have shown up as a contribution from Richard Rawl to my campaign, so I'm not sure I can answer your question without you know, digging into things. Do you know how much money uh, Mr. Rawl contributed to your attorney general campaign through whatever means he used? I don't know. And, and I would just say this. Um, I want to make sure we're very clear on this. You just said to my, my campaign through whatever vehicle he might have used. Um, a donation made to a PAC that's controlled by Mark Shirtloff um, that has a certain amount of money is not necessarily or even reasonably construed as a, a donation of my campaign. So I. I don't want you to, to make it look like I'm testifying that a donation of Mark Shirtless Pack was a donation to me. I'm not saying that.